Welcome to Talkin' Tigers. I'm Rachel Whitaker. We switched to basketball today with LSU's big showdown tonight. So let's welcome in LSU columnist Ron Higgins for a preview of the SEC Big 12 Challenge. Well, Ron, the Tigers beat UMass on Tuesday by 22 points, and now they take on unbeaten West Virginia in Morgantown. So how do they knock off the Mountaineers? Well, they, they, they do the same things against UMass. I mean, I thought it was LSU's best game of the year by far. I mean, I mean there was, uh, you know, Josh Gray at point guard. Uh, you know, last year, LSU's guards, I mean, their, their point basically, Anthony Hickey was a, a shooter. Josh Gray is a scorer. You know, and what, what that means is that he may not be a great shooter, but he knows how to get to the basket. He knows how to get to the free throw line. He knows how to create points for his teammates. And when he plays like he did last night, I think he had 25. Uh, other night against UMass, I mean, he had 25. He, he is really effective, and it makes everybody around him better. It takes, it takes pressure off of Jordan Mickey. Uh, and, uh, and it takes pressure off the rest of the lineup when he plays like that. And LSU needs this win against West Virginia for its NSA tournament resume later on. This is the type of thing you can point out and say, you know, we beat an unbeaten team uh, away from our house. So this game is very key for LSU. Right, no oh, doubt. Oh, and Coach Johnny Jones uh, praised Josh Gray's 25 points that sparked their last win right here. I think what Josh has done was really try to really do a great job of buying in what we've asked him to do, especially with the caliber of players that we really have around him. Uh, did a great job of sharing the ball. Uh, they did a great job, I thought, uh, UMass, of staying down, trying to make sure that they took Drill and Jordan away in terms of scoring threats, and it allowed Josh and Opening to really get to the basket. And I thought he picked his spots tonight in a timely fashion and made some big plays. Gray certainly made an impact against UMass at the PMAG along with several other Tigers and they won the all-important rebounding battle too so we'll see what happens tonight. Ron, thanks a lot. Enjoy Atlanta this weekend. I will. Thanks, Rachel. <laughs> and thank you for watching Talkin' Tigers. I'll see you Friday for more on the hardwood. Thanks for watching.